That's a 22, that's a 50 cal, and a Desert Eagle, and there is a 50 cal from the BMG. All right, when you're ready. 50! Hey everybody, Joel Hansen here. Today, it's very sunny, but beautiful day here in Las Vegas, and we are at the one and only Roll and Smoke Barbecue. Here with my good friend, Mr. Liam, good longtime friend. Today, we are here to try what is undoubtedly Las Vegas' best all-you-can-eat barbecue. I'm serious, guys. All-you-can-eat barbecue, all for only 35 bucks. I'm so excited. This food is world-renowned, not to mention all-you-can-eat. You know I love to eat. Let's head on in, get some glorious food, check out what the Roll and Smoke has to offer, and this is gonna be amazing. Everybody, so all you can eat barbecue, seriously, this is amazing. And this food looks so good. Look at the size of these beef ribs. This thing is actually giant. Like, I know where I'm starting. So we have a nice variety of the traditional sauces. We have some beef ribs to start. We also have some briskets, some burnt ends, uh, some pork back ribs, some baby back ribs. We even got some pulled pork sandwich. So it's absolutely delicious. I can't mac and remember. cheese. Yeah, mac and cheese, some beans, some coleslaw. So without ado, let's dig in. This is going to be good, no doubt. Man, just like, look at that thing. I'm just gonna bite into that. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. I think I need a minute. Oh. Man. So meaty. So smoky. Here we have a 50 cal round because you know nothing goes better with guns and barbecue in America. Look at that. Right there. Right on the table. Freedom. Oh man, this is so good. Oh, pulled pork is good too. Let me try one of those ribs. Yeah, do it. It's perfectly tender, soft, massive. I've never seen a rib this size. Yeah, these it, are literally the, the big, rib is like a plate. Yeah, literally the biggest beef ribs I've ever seen. I'm gonna rip some of this off and then dip it into one of these beautiful sauces. Let's see what we got here. Mm. So good. The sauces here too are kind of like a uh, kind of traditional, more like almost Carolina style sauce. They're not like a very, very thick base sauce. They're more of like a, a little more of a vinegary, a little thinner, I'll show you. Yeah. They're damn good. Oh, love the smokiness of this beef rib. Just look at that. Did you see how they just fell that bone? Look at that. This one's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet? Oh, but smoky flavor though. Mm, nice, sweet and smoky. Ooh, look at that. This is just like, this is too good. Oh my God. Where have you been all my life? I've eaten a lot of barbecue. This is by far some of the best. Here we have, some burnt ends. Nice and juicy looking. Nice and soft. Nice and sweet. Definitely tender. Got that really rich burnt end. Ooh, that's really good. I like that. Gotta try a lovely brisket too. Lovely looking piece of brisket. Nice smoke ring. Nice little subtle smoke ring up there at the top. See that nice little pink lines across there? Watch this. I bet, I bet this is just gonna rip apart. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh man. That's beef. That's orgasm. Oh my god. Oh my god. All that fat. 
on the brisket. Oh my gosh, it just melts. It's so delicious. Try that, man. You're gonna love that. And the best part about this is literally it's like all we can eat. So this is just our first round. Here we have some beans. These beans look absolutely delicious. There is a nice thick. There's lots of stuff in it. Flavor, man. You don't even need the sauce. You don't even need sauce. Oh wow. This tastes so nice. Lots of peppers in it. Like pepper, black pepper. I think there's like jalapenos in it. Jalapenos. Jalapenos. It's just so flavorful. Here we have a pork rib. Beautiful looking baby back rib. Nice, clear, defined smoke ring on it. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back rib. Let's take a bite without sauce. Oh yeah. Nice and smoky. Try this lovely coleslaw. It's called the Chipotle coleslaw. Well, there's even corn in it. Oh wow! Very smoky, creamy, but yet it kind of still has that nice acidity. Very very good. Would recommend. Definitely a buy. Definitely a buy. I go. It's only 35 bucks. I would pay way more for all those. Phenomenal. No sharing, no to go this way. Absolutely phenomenal. Oh man. Burn in. How's that old mac and cheese? Delicious, like everything else. Mac and cheese, definitely homemade. Liam, describe the mac and cheese in that. Cheesy, <laughs> sharp cheddar, nice. amazing. Amazing. Here's the old pulled pork sandwich. Looks absolutely delectable. Huge. Yeah, massive too. All right, I gotta try a bite of it. I'm thinking I might put a little bit of sauce on it. I got a nice little house-made mustard sauce here. Give us a nice little bite. Oh yeah. Oh. Love it. Smoky, sweet, not overpowering. Exceptional. It's got a bigger bag than this thing. Yeah, it's a bigger bag than the 50 cal. You gotta be able to watch us shoot that 50 cal here shortly. All right, definitely gonna have a uh, another beef rib here. My gosh, look at this beautiful, jiggly, massive deliciousness. Uh, it's like jiggly, massive deliciousness. <laughs> so good.
All right, round two. Got some similar awesome items. Look at that huge beef rib. That is amazing. Love that. One with the chopped brisket instead of the sliced. We also got some of these ginormous chicken wings, smoked chicken wings. Tried some corn nuggets. Apparently these are an uh, awesome must-have unique item. The corn bread, of course, because that is amazing and it's freaking warm. And then the beans again. Freaking warm. Freaking warm. Alright. Oh man, I don't even know where to start. I'll try a corn nugget. Wonder if they Tastes like fried corn. Yeah, that's delicious. It's almost like cornbread. What do you mean? Corn nugget. It's my first time ever having a corn nugget. This is damn good. How would you describe it? It's in corn. <laughs> Battered and deep fried. And yeah. Delicious. It's like a uh, it's like a mix of a chicken nugget and cornbread. Right, let's try with these beautiful wings. Absolutely massive. All right, let's go. Oh my god, dude! I honestly didn't know a chicken wing could taste so good. Yeah, that's, that's speechless right there. I don't know what they put on the outside. Really good. Whatever they put on, it's amazing. Like, that's exceptional. Like a little zest. I wonder if it's like the lemon pepper. The mentioned lemon pepper is kind of their niche. And also the barbecue is great. Wow. Hands down, best chicken wing I've ever had. Smoky, really nice and smoky. Let's try this awesome cornbread, which is beautifully soft and glistening and very warm. I've never eaten cornbread that wasn't like rock hard. Wow. It clearly, like, they totally just poured butter on this thing. It is so soft and moist. I didn't even have to chew this. The cornbread literally just melted in my mouth. I've never had cornbread like that. Hot damn. Just when you think things can't get any better, things keep getting better. And still, look at that beautiful beef rib. Would you just look at it? Yes, look at it. Would you eat this thing? If you would, comment below. That's what I feel. When words can't describe, just ah, amazing. It's too good. It's too good. I think I'm gonna move to Vegas just for this barbecue. Well, yeah, I just ripped that off the bone. Hallelujah. I'm a big fan of like a heavy smoke. And this is the perfect level because it's so tasteful and distinguishable, but it's not overpowering. Look at the glistening on my fingers from those beef ribs. Look at that. Oh. That is heart attack, grill level greasy. Except this is better. <laughs> This is on a whole different level. All the level. Try some uh, chopped brisket. Also, pickles are good. Generally with the chopped brisket, sometimes it's like 
a little, a little bit more like fat in it, kind of, because it's from the ends. But this seems really like not overly fatty or greasy. It still tastes like delicious brisket. I guess things so heavy. Liam's doing curls with the beef ribs. They are literally that big and heavy. <laughs> hey, look at that. Oh. Just look at that beef rib. That's what I'm looking at. Huge. Literally, I bet they're like over a half pound each. Like a half pound of meat. Serious, half pound of meat plus the bone. Probably a pound of rib. I'm finishing Liam's plate because he's running low on space. But man, like so good and it's so filling. Because there's just so much like awesome, delicious fat and stuff. Like, oh, it's so juicy. Can you see this? Can I squeeze it? It just glistens with juice. Look at this little bit. Look at that glistening. Got my fingers. It's just too tasty. It's too tasty for its own good. Stuff. Stuff. It's all you can eat, 35 bucks. Definitely a buy. Check out the size of that gun. Pull out the shoulder. That is me with a 50 cal. It's, uh, I don't think the gun's big enough. Yeah. That's the size of the 50 BMG. This is America. <laughs> this is America. Guns, barbecue. Can't ask for anything more. Very large guns, large appetites, and endless barbecue. This is exceptional. I think we're gonna call it on the meats because we have some desserts to try. But like, just phenomenal. Everything is absolutely great. Really enjoyed it. Liam, what's your favorite item today? I'm go with those those beef ribs and the ends, really. Yeah, beef ribs, brand, brisket. We're both beef fans, and it was damn good. But everything was exceptional. Cornbread was great, corn nuggets were great. Chicken wings were exceptional as well. I just, there's nothing bad at all. There's nothing that was even just mediocre, everything was exceptional. So, let's eat some dessert. Dessert time, and dessert is something we don't take lightly because dessert's awesome. So is America. Here's 50 cap. All right, so we got a uh, lovely ice cream with cookie, or cookie crumbles and a banana pudding. Let's see this. Look at this. This, this looks beautiful on the side. Just look how they layer that. And this thing is massive. And they, they make it here. I'm a big banana pudding fan. It's, oh, wow, it smells. Ugh. Man, that smells delicious. Let's try this base nizzle. Alright, ice cream, cookies, how can you go wrong? Oh my god. Even the ice cream is super good. It's a world of difference. How is that? Really good. Really good. Like, really great texture. It's not like that. Fake pudding. Yeah, not just like a generic pudding. Yeah. Like it's real. Man, you gotta try this ice cream. It's such a, I think it's a soft serve, but it's such a nice, rich vanilla. It's so light, it's almost like it's airy. Yeah, trade. Alright, banana pudding, one of my favorites. Cookie crumbs and all, whipped cream. That beautiful stuff. That's a banana pudding. Just when I thought this couldn't get any better, that is phenomenal. And you can tell it's made with real bananas. It tastes like real bananas. Just a world of difference. 
Like, I really do not think this place can get any better, but this is absolutely exceptional. Like, I can't really get them. My God. So fresh, light, and sweet. That's delicious, man. Give it a little yellow wafer. Pizzas. Ice cream can do that. It's like surprising or like exceptional. Even for like a saucer. Cookie crumbles. Yum. They also actually have an, an all you can eat ice cream option. So you can get all you can eat ice cream cones. For only five bucks, four dollars and ninety nine cents. All you can eat ice cream. That's ridiculous, and this is delicious. Maybe I'll have to come back for all you can eat ice cream. Another food challenge? Yeah, food challenge. This is exceptional. That's a good. Yeah, it just tastes like banana. Yeah, like real bananas. It's not just like a package. It's a. It's legit. This is banana pudding. I think it's called Mama's banana pudding. It's it's it's, it's great. Yeah. Yeah. Just look at this. Oh man. Get some like little piece of banana. Like that one. So light. I like it. Sir. Is it a buy? Definitely a buy. Definitely a buy. So that everybody. That's pretty much our rolling smoke experience. If we get anything else, we'll let you know. But these are phenomenal. Absolutely love it. Maybe we'll even get more. Well, everybody, I want to thank you for watching. Huge thank you to the Rolling Smoke. Uh, great place. Absolutely would recommend. 10 out of 10. This is Las Vegas' best all-you-can-eat barbecue. Hands down. Exception. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Shout out to Las Vegas, America. Go shoot a 50 cal. And uh, until next time, happy eating. So right now, I am on a military spec Humvee. Like, literally, look at this. We got the bench seats. We're in, like, open top. We got camouflage. This is, this is pretty freaking hilarious. Like, everything's flying all over. There goes my bag. And we're just cruising down the road. In a Humvee. Um, that's definitely a must see. Um, you guys are feeling all adventurous. Right there. Yeah, the rides, right? Yeah. We're gonna definitely do that. Yeah. Have you done it? Look at this beast. This is the ride today. Nice tank, no big deal. Not bad. <laughs> nice, uh, nice piece of uh, equipment. I've seen a few of these laying in people's yards, you know. So just you know, gotta to see what one, what, what they really offer. And that's a 50 gallon. Yeah, that's a monster. Hollow point. Wow, that's huge. Yeah, so uh, that's a 22, that's a 50 cal, and a Desert Eagle, and there is a 50 cal from the BMG. <laughs> Take a video of me here. Take a video of me here. Right hand. Right hand. Shoulder. Reach down again. Lift the circle. Are you okay? Shoulder. Yep, sorry. Got out. You're ready. Especially at all. Especially at all. Look at the size of those rounds.
good. Lower. Crazy. It goes so quick. <laughs> Holy jump. Take video? Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, they put that None on. at all. Yeah, it just sits here. Like the 1990s, it just sits here. Left hand. Let me know when you can see the red before you shoot. Alright, go ahead, fire for three. 50! You can't get it really loud. Whoa! Oh, yeah. Pretty good. Get that round. Pretty good. Yeah, that's huge. Look at this clip. That's gonna be tough to beat, man. Nice. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good job, Liam. Got a good shot. He's dead. When you're ready. 50! Jesus! 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 Man, where'd you get? Dude, I felt that from here. <laughs>